What's up fam? So today we're talking about Iron Finance. What happened in the last 24 hours? How much money did I personally lose? Which I'll be discussing at the very end of this video. And what exactly was Iron Finance and is it still something to look into? I'll answer all those questions and remember to like and subscribe, smash the like button, ring that notification bell. And if you're new to the channel, thank you for joining me on this journey. Uh, it's, it's, I share the ups and downs and everything in between. So let's get right into it. So um, this is Iron Finance. It was a $2 billion project uh, as of a couple days ago. Um, and now uh, it's just slowly getting bled out. And even though it's still at $244 million, which is quite a big uh, number compared to other projects, uh, they did lose a lot of their uh, steam really quickly. And so pretty, pretty insane. Um, if we look at the price of Titan, it was at $60 just a, uh, a few days ago. Oh, maybe uh, yesterday actually and it has since been dropping to zero. And many people think that might be a rug pull, and we'll get in that, into the details about it uh, here shortly, but pretty much the, on their website it says, do not uh, buy anything. There is no exploit, there is no hack, uh, no rug pulling was involved. They'll be sharing the details here shortly. Um, as far as their farms, they have 12 million in their farms, vaults, uh, I think is just completely shut down. It looks like their treasury. Um, I don't know. Uh, not much here to kind of say the least. Um, so what happened? Was was Mark Cuban hit by a rug uh, DeFi rug pull or, or what? So essentially what happened was if we go to uh, this anatomy of the downfall, there was no exploit or malicious activity from the reports received until now, simply a bank run where people kept cashing out and the token price kept falling. The way it works is with Iron Finance is there are two tokens, Iron and Titan. The USDC is deposited into the protocol upon users minting Iron token, while the Titan token used for minting is burned. When the user redeems, the USDC is paid back and the Titan is minted back. So, uh, what happened, it was just a, as one became unstable, it unstabilized the other one and it just made this huge crash in the market where essentially uh, one was uh, just printing too much while others were cashing out, which inflated the price and made the other uh, token just be liquefied. So uh, as you can see here, it says, please withdraw all liquidity from all pools. We will share the post mortem as soon as they have a better understanding of this bankroll. So a lot of people upset um, at this project. Uh, it has already 22,000 followers and they just joined uh, six months ago. So like I said, it was a very new project. Um, but yeah, I, so how much did I lose? Uh, I lost about $4,000, um, obviously in the grand scheme of things. You know, it was a learning opportunity. Uh, was it my life savings? No, you should never be investing in anything that uh, you are going to ape on and just think that uh, you can't, you shouldn't invest anything you can't, aren't willing to lose. So uh, what I was doing is I was investing ma uh, wrapped Matic versus Titan. And then I also collateralized um, some of my Matic on uh, a, uh, Avi and uh, took out a loan against Iron and uh, what was it? Iron and USDC and USDC. Yep. And I was uh, noticed that Titan was going down, so I ended up pulling back my position, my position on my loan. I paid back the loan really quickly, um, and I didn't lose any money there. But looking when I was watching Titan, it went from being up like $40 uh, in an hour to $100 in like an hour and a half. And I was like, wow, this is pretty amazing. And then it dropped like $1,000. I was like, oh, that's really weird. And um, maybe I just was missing something. And then it dropped another thousand and I was just like, something's not up. Uh, so I ended up pulling out. Uh, I 
Good thing I did because I would have lost all 6,000, but I only lost 4,000. So I was able to recover some of my investment. Um, not much, but it is what it is. Uh, lesson learned and, um, you know, that's, that's all I can say. Um, yeah, it was it was a uh, learning experience, definitely. And uh, just like anything, definitely understand the risks with your uh, investing, understand and do your own research and definitely um, be mindful of uh, what you're investing in. And even if it looks like a amazing project at two billion dollars, uh, it could go quite low. Um, that's just the, the name of the game in crypto. So find a project that you love, uh, be mindful of DeFi projects and just crypto in general, understand the risks that are involved and uh, follow along on this journey with me. So uh, you can see me get wrecked. <laughs> that's it guys, until next time, remember to like and subscribe, smash the like button, ring that notification bell and until next time, peace.